Welcome to You Are The Chef. I'm Heidi and we're here at the Renaissance Shanghai You Garden Hotel. And we have a very special chef who's going to be teaching us how to create dishes using lobster. Now, lobster is an absolutely fabulous, luxurious item. And he's going to be teaching us how to use it in five different Chinese style dishes. But before we start cooking, let's see who that chef is. Our chef today is Chef Max Zhao. He has a wealth of experience in the culinary industry for over 18 years. Instead of focusing on traditional Shanghai-style specialities, Zhao renewed the menu with many innovative dishes combining Chinese and Western elements. We're looking forward to what he's going to bring us this week. Today's dish is a fabulous combination of both lobster and crab meat. Using an innovative way to combine these two meats, this dish is amazing in its flavour and they are perfectly matched. Okay, the claws. You can see that the meat has been beautifully pulled out of the shell. Okay. 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 Obviously, if you're not buying it like this, you need to peel quite a few crabs to get this amount of shefen. Ah! Okay. Okay. 对全好以后我们先放在盘子里面它会不会大开啊不会的是吗因为我们真的是会用跑鲜膜啊可以要做多少个我们做两个可以好好嗯其实经常在中国菜会配鞋粉和冬瓜在一起是不是也有一个真的
那这个是为了我们的那个冬瓜，或者是为了我们的龙虾？为了我们的燕窝。燕窝也放进去了。对的。哇！好，现在我们轻轻的打一个薄圈。OK。哎，怎么样？好，现在我们就要把它先装在一个器皿里面。哦，这个？对。好，那我把这个全部装满了，是吧？嗯，装不要装太满，因为上面还要放燕窝。哦、OK。啊、哦。好，现在我们放这里备用。OK。现在我们把这个先拿过来。Yep. 我们这个龙虾是叫波士顿。波士顿龙虾，对对对，我们就波士顿龙虾最主要是吃的这个钳子。嗯哼，现在我们把波士顿龙虾已经处理好。OK， 先这里割条口子。哦，为什么？这个，因为我们里面要放一点 cheese。啊，它的香味和鲜味会出来。哇哦，所以是不要放太多，是吗？对，因为多了你会抢住它的鲜味。对对对对对对。Wow, what a cool idea! Just by making a little slit, you can't even see that it's there, but it should give quite an, a lot of extra flavor. Okay. Now we're going to add a little pepper. Okay, so now pepper. So we're going to pepper. Ah, it's very thin. We can cut it. Thin, thin, right? Yes. Now we're going to make a little pepper. Okay. Yes. 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 Yes.
wanting to know how to choose the best type of lobster. Well, you want something that's still quite alive, so when you pick it up, the tail should actually curl under its body. Then, when you get it home, put some damp cloth over the top and you can put it in the fridge. Make sure that you don't put it into fresh water because it's sure to die. And always eat your seafood, especially your lobster, within 18 hours. And that's my tip of the day. I'm interested to see what the cheese is like inside this. Mmm. A nice salty sort of texture to it. And the cheese sort of just brings it a little bit of extra flavour, but there's not a lot of cheese in it, so it's really, it's nice, it's not overpowering. Well, chain chung digger. Mmm. Mm. The winter melon is very cleansing, so put with the crab, which is a lot oilier, put together it actually creates the perfect balance. It's a little cool, fresh, but then a lot of richness behind it. That's a fabulous dish. And if you've got a girlfriend, you might think, ooh, we're going to have a nice evening out. This is the kind of dish that you want to be eating. That is it for us this week. We're finding out really how to use lobster in our kitchen. So remember to stay tuned all this week and we've got all these fabulous dishes. Thanks to Max. We'll see you then. <laughs>